in 2021. I'm most looking forward to uh, all of the incredible work um, that we're going to roll out. We're going to get back to meeting our audiences. We are um, we have really exciting plans for a range of works and projects and opportunities to connect even more deeply with our communities in the east of England and um, yeah give people some great nights out, great days out and bring joy back into people's lives because we certainly need that. One of the best things that's happened this year um, and that is actually quite good I think is that we've proved that we've got resilience, um, that artists have resilience and that no matter what people keep throwing at us uh, we will continue to make work because it's important and it's viable and it's brilliant and it what makes the world much better. In a lot of ways it was also an amazing year um, because I was able to be creative um, despite all of that chaos and one of the ways that I was able to stay creative was by bringing my dog for lots of walks in the woods um, because when I'm in the woods I just forget about all of the problems. Lockdown survival essentials. Eyebrow pencil. Chocolate buttons. Lots. say no um i really got into plants yeah house plants a new house plant shop opened in january near me and i just started buying plants and something i was trying to do was to learn a handstand and i never succeeded and oh, i'm really sad about that but i feel good that 2021 is going to be the year of the handstand i'm actually spending new year um back in the midlands with my dad <laughs> and I don't think I've spent New Year with my dad ever so I think I'm just gonna get really drunk with my dad and dance the patter patter. In 2020 I think I learned how to spend 10 hours straight watching the news without moving once um, yeah, hopefully won't be taking that into um, 2021. The thing that I'm looking forward to in 2021 is being back out there, seeing the people that I love, making work that I love, and supporting artists in the best way that we know how by making things happen. This holiday season, we're excited because we get to light the menorah and we get a visit from Santa. What do you want from Santa, Rosie? Okay, the You heard it here first. Merry Christmas. With lots and lots of love, take care and we'll see you next year. Mm -hmm.